jokes of John Cena though he hasn't imaginary friends like Ricky Stanicky. He was able to persuade WWE fans that he's invisible John Cena has been a popular WWE superstar for a long time, and he has gradually given moviegoers reason to think that he is also a serious comedy heavyweight, though he clearly excels in cameos like the one in which he plays the accidentally cast Ken Maid in Barbie. Or the winning lead in James Gunn's Peacemaker series, his real brilliance comes when he plays a fairly ordinary loser, as he did in Peter Farrelly's romp Ricky Stanicky. Cena did remind everyone that he essentially granted himself the ability to disappear early in his WWE career, even though he acknowledges he has never used an imaginary friend to justify his actions. Years before he played the Atlantic City erotic parody performer who found a new lease on life via the faux Ricky Stanicky persona, John Cena was helping sell out arenas with the WWE. Early on in his run, he brought the catchphrase you can't see me into the zeitgeist, which enjoyed a high level of popularity amongst wrestling fans before becoming hitting Hall of Fame tiers of meme culture post-2015. The trainwreck vet referenced the many memes taking his catchphrase literally when speaking with USA Today, when asked if he'd ever blamed anything on an imaginary friend. In his words, even though Cena himself wasn't directly responsible for his entrance theme the time is now becoming as solid an internet gotcha as the Rick Roll, nor for the many doctored images playing on his you-can't-see-me catchphrase. He deserves the credit for putting the ingredients out there for fans to utilize with Alchmeme. I'd say it was Nostradamus-like, but you can't see a thing like that coming.